Hey guys, welcome back to my garden. I got a nice update for you today with the indoor cucumber plant. This is going to be a self-pollinating cucumber plant and you could see as I spin it around the leaves are looking nice and beautiful and it's really green and it looks super healthy. Now if I actually bring you inside a little bit closer you begin to see the flowers are beginning to form and I'm super excited about that which means it's time to basically upgrade the system I believe. This is growing in a little quart size jar right now. I think it's a little small. I'm actually going to turn it into a five gallon bucket. I got it right over here. I, I just washed it up and it's going to be a deep water culture system. I'm going to use um, an added pump and an air stone and it's going to be really good guys. I'll show you how I set that up a little bit later today or I might just throw that up so it should be really easy and you could see let me lift it up a little bit looks nice and compact look at that try to get in close always hard to get these like really up close angles unfortunately but you guys could see just how nice and healthy this is looking uh, I showed the root system yesterday cucumbers are a little finicky you don't want to mess around with the roots too much but I'll show it real quick today uh, look at this beautiful looking healthy white root system and let's take a look at the nutrients there's still barely anything left actually so it's a good thing I checked it out today and especially at this stage now that it's beginning to put on flowers it's going to begin to definitely consume a lot more water and nutrients at, at the same time so I want to be able to give it a nice little added boost and nice space this way it has an adequate area to grow and produce for me but overall I'm really happy with the growth for now so it's really compact this plant is going to be a heavy producer um, unfortunately I confused <laughs> which uh, which cucumber plant this was I'm not sure if it's the diva or if it's the the other one that I used to grow I forget the name of it uh, but it look overall guys it looks really good I think beautiful looking healthy plant I'm gonna leave the root system alone I'm, there's no need to trim it since I'm upgrading the the size of the bucket and I'm gonna be adding an air stone as well Let me see if I can grab it for you real quick so you see basically I'm gonna be using the tubing got a little air stone right there at the bottom and yeah it's gonna be good guys and things are going really well in the garden right now Swiss shards grown beautifully look at that pak choy looks absolutely phenomenal it's almost getting ready to harvest soon it's about an inch, inch and a half tall right now. I want it to grow maybe one or two more leaves and then I'll probably harvest it. I'll show you guys that later. And I'm even doing a little experiment right over here with some pak choy. I basically just threw a seedling that germinated just in a little glass cup with some uh, clay pebbles and some water. That's it. So let's see if it's able to grow its full life cycle, right? Like just like that. And as well as I'm going to be using a little, little Ziploc baggy method right here. I just basically poured a little water right there at the bottom and I left it open up top this way it has nice airflow it doesn't get too musty in there and you could see the condensation built up real nice and when I touch it it feels nice and warm in there the ziplock bag definitely increases the heat overall from these grow lights over here so give it a nice little greenhouse effect and you can see that they're growing nicely so that's what it looks like right now this is basically like day two I planted these yesterday in the little in this bag so we'll be back basically in a couple of weeks or so i'll show you guys just how fast this grows and how it looks so for now i'm gonna basically upgrade the cucumber system right now to the five gallon uh bucket the deep water culture system add the air pump I'm gonna put the stone I'll, I'll set that up it should be nice and quick and simple so we'll be back soon guys for more as always if you like the episode please don't forget to hit that thumbs up it always helps me greatly post any messages or comments down below and i'll do my best to respond Thanks, Dylan. We'll be back soon for more, guys.